Hi Pisces, welcome back to Clear Compassion. This is Deirdre. Thank you so much for joining today. I am here with Spirit to bring light, love, and clarity from the divine. Please take the messages that honor your highest good and leave that which does not resonate. All right, let's see what's going on in the soul world. You are entering the temple of your truth and you are going to learn to value it. I like this card. This is about something major um, that's about to take place or happen in your life. It's an experience that's going to change you, all right? So as you um, go about your day, all right, there is something where you are going to have to take some time of silence uh, to prepare for this. And it's also a reminder to respect and tolerate others as they have their own truth. But the focus is on you. And the reason for that, it's like, the reason we like today is it's our do-over from yesterday, right? And it's also about something that you want and your soul is asking you to let me out, so to speak, right? It's, it's like you have to go within and in this silence act, you will find your own truth. Look at this temple as your house and how you want to express who you are and what you represent, all right? Because deep in your heart, you're gonna find the answers to the questions that prompted you for such guidance. This is newfound truth. And whatever this newfound truth is, it's going to be with you for a very long time because it's going to be the purest form of who you are at a soul level. This is bigger than you think, but it's more powerful because from here you are going to step into this, this temple where you're going to be able to see at every angle right? This is no longer being closed off. You are representing your highest self. And it's coming from a respect that you have and a love of your own that makes you who you are, that no one can take it away from you. Now, let's go into the reading and I think we're going to use these same cards today for Pisces and to ask the spirit guides and ascended masters and higher beings how they can help assist Pisces on this truth and new pathway. Some of you also may be moving. Just throwing it out there because I see it. All right. Here we go. First one. Wow. I think this is the third reading I did today where the light of the world came out. <laughs> and it, it makes sense because we're all always so busy trying to find our purpose, where we're supposed to be, what is our life mission, um, what's my new job going to be like? Who are the people that are going to be coming into my life? And spirit is like, look, stop being so busy in your head with all of those details and pay close attention to whatever it is that's the um, main directive of your vision because it has something to do with your truth. So if you are questioning what you're personally doing to uh, elevate your career, for instance, and you're questioning it because you don't know if it's the right thing for you, well, ask yourself, why are you questioning it, number one? And number two, is it coming from a place of self-doubt or because of it's coming from a place of unknowing? Or is something else like brought to your imagination that, no, if I do this, then maybe I could come over here and change things up. And that's what I truly want. So this is why you have to enter the temple of your truth 
to get out of your head and stop busying yourself with all of these different ideas and kind of like just find that one common denominator. What is the main goal that you're trying to achieve here? The Buddha prepares. Again, silence. Preparing yourself in stillness. This is what's going to bring the answers to you. When you sit quietly for direction, it shows you the purpose. The time to act is coming, but not just yet. This experience that you're going to go through is going to bring that enlightenment. So it's around the corner. <gasps> I think it was cancer that got the sands of time as well. And this is for me, as always, it's time to roll up your sleeves, people, and get to work. So you see, once you're in stillness, you'll have the motivation, the inspiration, and time is going to be moving very quickly. You're going to start planning ahead. And you're going to find the directive of what it is that you have to take care of. And you're going to start prioritizing. But it will be a busy time. Two of Roses, winged messages. Roses are all about love, purity, and healing. And I see this is a spiritual healing that's taking place here. This is about being of higher self, right? Um, to avoid and resolve misunderstandings. Once you understand who you truly are, even if out of respect for others and their truth, you're able to know what is meant for you and what isn't. Are You know what I mean? Like, are you going to come to this table and have peace with this other person or party? Or are you going to just let this go? I feel like maybe somebody else is coming in and this is spirit also guiding this so that you could have some sort of closure so that you can continue to move forward. I love Archangel Gabrielle. Okay, so Archangel Gabrielle is all about communication. So the communication is coming in. Are you going to sit at this table and have a healthy discussion to resolve any differences? Or is this discussion even necessary because you know your own truth now? Use your power of expression and Archangel Gabrielle is here to give you that. So that you can rise above it. It is your sacred word of truth to communicate. Well, Pisces, if you're not being divinely supported right now, here and today, you must feel this energy around you. Archangel Michael is supporting you completely. He's showering you not only with protection, but with his love. This is you being strong, resourceful, and trusting your convictions. Only take action on what compels you to do so, as long as it comes from your heart. Add some. This is you arriving. Your spirits from past lives are supporting you. They're giving you a big pat on the back. The knowledge that you seek is coming to you because you're putting in the work. This is going to affirm your strength so that you can remain focused.
This is so interesting. You and cancer have something in common, for sure. Maybe you're dealing with a cancer. I'm not sure, but <laughs> both of you are steady, strong, grounded. This two of forces, this willow is like you can bend, but you won't break, right? You can compromise, but you're not, you're not going to change your point of view on something because you know in your heart of hearts that this is what you stand for. And regardless of all the emotions that are flowing through you, spirit is behind you all of the way, continuing to give you this beautiful growth so that you can withstand any forces. I love this. More forces, more balance, yes. When you find your truth and you completely understand it and you know how to use it, that's when you come into complete balance. This is where you are able to see not everybody's side of things, but then how to deal with those. You keep everything in check. This is something that doesn't throw your equilibrium off through your studies, through what you, you have written for yourself, in other words. Spirit is shining the light on everything that you have come to know and giving you the ability to use it to keep yourself in alignment with your soul mission. This is you no longer being caught in the ruins. You're not going to feel stuck or unhappy. This card represents self-destruction. You're not going to start self-sabotaging yourself over the feelings of another party. You're going to open up this gate. You're going to walk right out. And you're going to start living the life that you want for yourself. All right, let's go ahead and see what Archangel Michael has for advice for Pisces today. Archangel Michael, what advice do you have for Pisces? What advice do you have for Pisces? One more, thank you. The way forward is open, okay? So Michael is saying, you're not trapped. Look at that. You are not trapped. Your possibilities and opportunities, they're endless, okay? And they are around the corner. You are on the right path to your joy, for sure. And Michael is guiding you to your personal and spiritual freedom. This is a very happy day for my beautiful Pisces. The truth comes out and sets you free. As cliche as that may sound, it is more profound than you imagine. All right, continue to like and subscribe. Take care, everyone.